What's up guys, Luke Nay here. Today I'm going to teach you how to install and use a plugin called Chest Shop for the latest bucket and Minecraft. So, for this to work on the latest bucket in Minecraft, you want to make sure that you have your bucket server updated and you get the download for this plugin that is updated for the bucket that you have and the Minecraft. So, as you see, I have 1.2.1.2. Ah, can't talk right now. 1.2.5, that is for the latest bucket bucket and minecraft so that's the one that i'm going to download i've already done it but pretty much you just hit save file and then save it to wherever you want so um yeah now that you're gonna have a pretty much a plugin called um chest shop on your desktop or wherever you save it pretty much just bring it to your desktop or whatever then open your server folder go to plugins and now you want to drag it from the desktop or wherever you have it into your plugins folder once you do that you want to go back and then just start your server and should work okay so there we go everything is up and running or at least everything should be up and running uh, so there we go uh, done okay so once everything finishes it should uh, you can hit stop and it's gonna generate a uh, file and plugins right here and you're gonna need notepad plus plus or whatever you're gonna use to view these files um, to um, edit them, so just go to config and hit edit with notepad plus plus or whatever else you want to use. You really don't need to edit anything in the configs that's extremely important. Uh, important, pretty much everything you'd edit would just change the, what it says when you buy. Um, pretty much just what it says when you interact with the plugin. So if you want to edit that, you can. It's pretty self-explanatory. Um, as you see right here, it's just you can change some numbers here and some XP and um, block update and partial transaction but uh, really I wouldn't mess with too much of this stuff um, yeah I wouldn't really mess with it too much unless you're you want to but I don't know I don't and then you can go into local actually just kidding this is where you edit what it says and this is just random stuff I guess I don't know I never really touch this stuff because everything you do with it's pretty much in game so I'll show you how to do that and also before I get to actually showing you in game um, for the permissions for this plugin uh, let me just see I'll go to the main plugin thread I guess um, and then I'll show you the permissions because you do need um, it is permission so as you see here the permissions and um, pretty much you just <coughs> uh, like put these in whatever um, user you want and then that's the commands they'll get so yeah so now let's start the server and I'll show you how to actually use it <coughs> so log in and the local host okay so now I'm on the server let's just make sure it's working so slash PL um, if we can look at chess shop should be green considering everything is green but let's just try to find it first that we know that way we know it's installed correctly so I do see it it's right there so it obviously is working I don't know really the commands for it maybe slash chest shop maybe okay so yeah that's pretty much the command that you can use to edit it but if you want to make an actual shop I'll show you how to do that all you need is a um, chest a locked one a chest and a sign and yeah um, so when you're making a shop you can have a shop so that when someone buys from it that um, they give money to you and the items they buy are from you or you can make a shop that's called an admin shop where the items that they buy are from the server and no one gains any currency so those are the two things you can do so let's just place a uh, chest down let's place a sign down so if you want to make an admin shop um, you type in admin shop and then you continue down to here and now let's type in um, this is the buy and sell price so you can type in B and now the buy price so 100 and that will be for a hundred uh, you can buy something for hundred dollars now and actually am I doing this right I think I'm doing this right Oh no, I'm not <laughs> not doing this right. Just wait. This is where you put the amount. So this will be one by a hundred colon 
50 sell or you can just have buy 100 or you can just have sell 100 depending what you want exactly and Apple wants to update my stuff and I don't want them to update it so yeah so buy 100 I'm just going to keep it to buy and sell and then I believe not 100% sure what you put there oh yeah item name obviously so now let's put just diamond so now hit done uh, shop is successfully created so if we do this right if I right click it I do buy a diamond as you see in the left hand corner it says you bought one diamond now I bought a ton now I'm going to click the other way and now I should be selling so yeah selling for 50 because this is an admin shop so now I will show you how to do an actual shop with a chest from the user so what you want to do if you want to do it from the user is you can either put their name right here or if you're the person who you want the shop to be for you just leave it blank so now put um um uh, one for the quantity now for the price buy a hundred colon 50 sell and put diamond again or whatever item specifically that you're going to use but as you see it automatically puts my name in there and if I buy it the, it opens the chest because nothing's currently there but uh, let's just put 64 diamond in here and now if we buy this it's gonna open the chest because it's my chest but I think I'm not exactly sure how this is gonna work I think I might I'm gonna put the chest in someone else's name I'm gonna see if that works I don't know if that works but I think maybe because I'm an admin it should work I'm not 100% sure so I should do beat it's 11 um, quantity 1 buy 100 colon 50 sell diamond okay so I don't know whether this is gonna work okay yes it did work so since I'm an admin I can create the uh, chest shop for another user um, I can open the chest because I'm an admin but if uh, a normal user would not be able to and as you see when I buy the diamonds they come out of the chest and now I can sell them back so as you see there now they're back here so that's pretty much the basics and how to use it um, just put the sign um, if it's one block away from the chest it's gonna work and that's pretty much just the basis so um, if you guys have any questions about the plugins leave them in the comments um, trying to think of anything else that might be important I'll just take a quick look at the page again anything else um, uh, ha -ha. okay I think that's just about it um, if you guys have any questions or I left anything out just leave them in the comment and I will help you out shout out to the guys who made it uh, these three people right here and other than that, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave this video a quick um, rating and maybe subscribe to my channel for more videos. Other than that, hope you enjoyed and bye.